Hello, and welcome back to Persona 5. Well, last time we went to Hawaii. And this time... You, you just guys showed up for some reason. But people are waiting for us to fix society. We don't got time to be relaxing over here. Oh yeah, and Ryuji really wants to go back because he's so excited about Hawaii and when it wasn't what he thought it was, now he wants to go back and be a fan of Leaf again. Okay. And that right, you... Yeah. Oh, wait, what the hell? Obviously, these travels provides a great opportunity for new insight. I prefer we stay here a bit longer. Hold on a sec! What are you doing here? Wasn't your school supposed to be going to Los Angeles? To tell the truth. Apparently, they couldn't land the plane due to a terrible storm brewing in the West Coast. There was no signs of it letting up, so our destination was changed at the, uh, on the spot to Hawaii. Huh. Hey, it's Fumi here. I want to go talk to Fumi. Do, do you just bring rain wherever you go? Could it be that what happened at the fireworks festival was his fault as well? Oh no, it didn't rain us out when we were at the beach. Don't worry. <laughs> Don't go bringing any storms here. You got that? Hmm. hmm. I'll do my best. Oh god, that's not very... That's not very reassuring. By the way, there's nothing planned after this. What are you going to do? Uh, going to do? Um, oh yeah, I still gotta buy souvenirs. My mom asked me to grab some stuff for her. Oh yeah! I totally forgot about that. We need to pick up things for Futaba and Morgana too. Hmm. I was hoping to do some shopping myself. But then it's settled. I wonder what Morgana would want. I don't think we can buy respect. Come on. Man, that group's totally the same, even outside Japan. <laughs> sort of like, not quite cohesive. Mm. Huh. I didn't realize Big Bang Burger was in Hawaii, too. Really? Oh, boy. Yeah, it's been getting real popular in Japan lately, but I guess I want to branch out. That reminds me. Now well, you mention it, I read the news articles recently about the success of Okamura Foods. Hmm. What's good points? I have been seeing them on the news a bunch over the past months. Ah, yes, that company that owns Big Bang Burger. Hmm? Okamura? Ain't that the guy who's at the top of the fan site rankings? Who? Is that true? I thought it was constantly changing. And we're gonna fucking do anything on that list. Oh my goodness. Let's not do anything on that list. Let's please not do anything on that list. I guarantee it. I don't make mistakes about that kind of stuff. <sighs> You're amazing, Ryuji. <laughs> right? <laughs> totally. Hmm. What's the matter? No, well, it's probably nothing. It's just a rumor I heard about Okamura Foods. Hmm. Supposedly, all their overseas competition has mysteriously pulled out. What of Japan? Wait, what about Wild Duck Burger? No. <gasps> oh, I get it. Big Bang. Okay, so. Okay, that's what they're doing. That's what they're doing. They're causing controversies and shit with all the other uh, brands to basically make the other brands not. Um, get any sort of success in Japan when they try to establish themselves. Like Wild Duck Burger apparently had something. I remember that being a thing in the news, right? Never mind, I'm surely just overthinking things. Sis's habits seem to be rubbing off on me. Well, she is a prosecutor. Whether she's sort of, uh, let's say bitchy, uh, doesn't really account to her general capability. Oh yeah! And, you know, habits. Hey. Why don't we take a pic together? You know, so we can all remember the trip and all. Didn't we already do that? Okay, well, whatever. Because that was before we left. Oh, good idea. Just line up over there. Are you sure you don't want to be in it? Thanks. Oh, wait. Wait, we did this once. Why do I... Yes. Okay, well, whatever. I only asked that you ensure the composition is well balanced. We, we did this before and I was in it, so I mean, we could do that again. Okay, whatever. Can you worry? Can you not worry about that stuff for one second? Hey, Yusuke, you want to take the picture? I'm perfectly willing to be in it. Actually, the fact that I'm not going to be in it makes me feel as though it's going to be. The, actually, the fact that I'm not going to be in it makes me feel as though that might be important soon. Go for it, Roku. Hey, 
<laughs> we still have some time to spare, right? Where to next? I mean, you, uh, can I be in a picture? Okay, no. Never mind. There's a convenience store down by the beach. How about there? It's not, uh, that sounds lovely. I would like, uh, I would quite like a short rest. Alright then. Alright, let's head over there. Huh. Okay. Wait. Don't you think the food round here is kind of salty? Yeah, it is America. <laughs> I don't know how Japanese cuisine is, but admittedly, salt is a, probably a, almost a staple in American food. <laughs> I mean, unless you go eat like some really nice cuisine that's not really caring about being cheap. I mean, because they were talking about it earlier. They wanted the cheap, quote-unquote, good food, right? You might be right. Oh, shoot. Sorry. Oh, I forgot my sunscreen. I'm going to buy another bottle at the convenience store. Oh. Uh, I'll go with you. Hmm. I guess we will need to wait for them to come back. <sighs> oh, I'm so bored. By the way. By the way, you think we're the thieves everyone here has been going on about? I doubt it. If they're going on about thieves, then it's probably an actual thief. That'd be freaking crazy if that was true, right? So crazy. So crazy. I see. Hmm. I had not heard of such rumors. It sounds wonderful. We are already here, so why don't we confirm it if that is the case? Oh, yeah, yeah good idea. Go. Let's go ask him around while we wait for Ana Makoto. Oh. Oh, I actually get to walk around. Woo! Hey. Oh, I've been a fan of these. In fact, I'm a big fan. Okay. I, okay. Maybe they're just calling them thieves over there. Overseas. Ah, it's so awesome how they kick the bad guys' asses. I wonder how they steal hearts. Oh. Hm. He actually seems quite knowledgeable. Dude. Damn, it's crazy how many people know about us. This is fucking awesome. Gotta say fuck. Always say fuck. And please, oh, like the ones from Japan. Oh. oh, yeah, I read about them in the news article recently. What of it? <laughs> That's actually all I wanted to know. Thanks. Yeah, okay. Just a random person coming up. Hey, my goodness, there's so many black people. <laughs> I'm weirdly impressed that they actually went out of their way to do that. <laughs> oh, and thieves. I've never heard of them. You kids are from Japan, right? Are these Phantom Thieves special people like Samurai or Geisha? Hmm. hmm. I suppose that understanding isn't necessarily incorrect for someone from a foreign country. Oh, wait, have we. You were not there the entire time. Hey. Huh? Hey. Ain't she kinda cute? Maybe we should ask her some questions too. No, she's from our school. Oh, boy. At least I think she's. <laughs> Has that been the loading screen this entire time? Ah. Free time is almost up. Shouldn't you be heading back soon? Huh? Are, are you a Shujin student? Yeah, I want to know what... It, really? And you, like, never actually wear the uniform. Okay. That's right. <laughs> By the way, your blonde friend seems very excited. Uh, uh, seemed very excited on the airplane coming here. Oh. Hey. That girl we saw watering the plants... Oh, you remember? That's good. Someone else remembers. Sorry to surprise you. I'm another third year who asked to come chaperone this trip. Oh. Okay, is that why Makoto knows you? I accept that it's to take my mind off things, but I wasn't sure how to spend my free time. What's up? Hmph. <laughs> We're here. I... I think I should be going. Oh, no. Will Makoto, like, take away your... Did she know better? She... I, I, I have a feeling you're not what you're telling us you are. See you. The fact that you're avoiding Mikoto so much is... Sorry, were you waiting long? Hmm. That girl you were talking to just now, do you know her? Nah. Nah. No, that was my first interaction with her. She said she was a third year, same as you, Mikoto. Uh-huh. I've never really spoken to her, though. Okay. I guess it's true. Hmm. Ah, uh, looks like our free time is over. Let's head back to the hotel. Oh, yeah, okay, well. Didn't... What's the point of going and buying sunscreen if you're gonna, like, buy it, come back, and, and as soon as you come back, you're gonna be like, Oh, great. One after another, too. 
What did you find? Still working, can't tell you. <laughs> she can handle this without me. I yeah, she can handle it without any of us. Ooh, so much. All I'm good for is driving them around in mementos. Well, that's not exactly a role that's useless. I'm basically useless. No. Kitty, your mumbling's distracting me. If you got something to say, just spit it out. It's nothing. What were you saying? Let me go. You feel so nice. I do not. So smooth and silky. It's kind of hard to believe fur this soft belongs to a human. Don't make me say it again. I'm a human. But wait, didn't you just... Couldn't you just be assuming that? I had the wrong assumptions about my mom for the longest time. That's not the same. I understand myself better than anyone. That's true. <sighs> oh. oh, boy. There are even more posts now. Oh, okay. And what have you been doing all day, Mishima? Just sitting in here on your phone, looking at the post? <laughs> oh, wow! The president of a company called Okumura Foods is rising very quickly up the rankings. Hmm. How convenient. I wonder why. Hmm. You know, we're on a trip, right? Come on! You can't let this chance pass you by! Yeah, we pass by what chance? It's rumored that Okumura Foods exploits their employees. Stuff like underpaying staff to reduce labor costs, that's how they have so many stores. Hmm. Have I worked at Big Bang? Oh, yeah! No, no, never mind. It wasn't actually Big Bang Burger I worked at, it was, um... It was another place that was completely understaffed, right? Yo. Oh, hi, Ridge. Yeah. Oh, okay. Just make yourself at home. Why are you here? Just hear me out. The guy I'm rooming with went and brought his girlfriend back to the room. Oh. He must have been jealous. It felt totally <laughs> awkward staying in there with him. Yeah, I don't blame you for that one at the very least. I'm just gonna sleep here tonight. Even though there are only two beds? Well, I am the Lita, so Mishima, Ryuji, get to know each other better. Coming! <laughs> oh no. Oh crap, does Yusuke even have a hotel? Oh no. Oh no. Oh. Oh wait, what? The girl I was sharing a room with took off to her boyfriend's room. <laughs> hey, Ryuji, go sleep with the comic. <laughs> I know that feeling. Yeah, I'm, I, I get a feeling that's probably the same group. Oh, okay. Ryuji, go get the key. I stepped outside for just a second and the auto lock kicked in. I can't get back in my room. Huh? You're looking at stuff online even over here? Ever since the Medjet case, many people from overseas have been accessing the website. Okay. Can... Okay. Can we... Un well, you know, uh, we have on if we really need to understand English, yeah? Isn't it crazy? The Phantom Thieves are finally making their worldwide debut! <sighs> oh, what should I do about overseas requests? Ignore them? We can't do anything about them? I, I don't think we're the ones you should ask about that. They took down Medjet! I wonder who they'll bring justice to next. Oh my goodness. I I mean, do you think An and Ryuji are the ones off, that are also part of the Phantom Thieves? Or is it just me that you think I am? I don't know. It's not just Japan anymore. 
the whole world's waiting to see the Phantom Thieves' next move. Ow. Oh. Wasn't that like in like the release trailer or some shit? <laughs> that reminds me, what time is it? Oh boy. So I'm feeling pretty pooped. You think this could be that jet lag thing? Hmm. It's been a couple days. I mean, are you consistently it's having the or whatever? Too much for me to go anywhere else. I'll just sleep in here tonight. <laughs> oh, come on. Wait, what? I don't. I don't know if that's a good idea. You should probably go back. This can only cause problems. I won't go back. No, this is a bad idea. Bad idea. You heard her. Oh no. There are only two beds. Even if someone sleeps on the sofa, one of us is gonna have to sleep on the floor. Well, these are what queen size beds. I never remember this so specific. Who's that gonna be? Oh, hey, playing cards. Why don't we use these to decide? Oh, great. <laughs> yes. But I'm all the way in Hawaii, and I'm stuck <laughs> sleeping on the floor. Uh, I mean, you could have gone to the your room and got the key from the girl, because almost fucking definitely the same group. But whatever. Hey, where'd Mishima go? Yeah, that might be just presumptuous, but you could have asked. You could have asked. He's in the bathroom. Okay. Ain't he been in there a while? Oh, no. The school trip. Shiho was really looking forward to this. <sighs> oh, great. Okay. Okay. On. Sorry. I didn't mean to bring the mood down. No, don't worry. Just, just go to sleep. We, we've dealt with this. I'm like on rank nine with you, yeah. But it's already been almost six months since then, hasn't it? <laughs> this all feels so strange. Right? Hard to believe the rowdy kids at school are now famous all over the world. Don't you think we still have a lot to learn about each other, though? Yeah, admittedly, I don't think we're all that close as a group. You know, things like what kind of people we like. So, time to come clean, Ryuji. <laughs> oh, you seem to have been like trying to get like, okay, he likes very large women that, I don't know, can dominate him? I don't know. Me? Just as a guess, just as a guess. Uh. Well, she's got to have a good personality. I'm okay with anyone who's modest and nice. <laughs> what about if two girls with equally good personalities confess to you at the same time? Why are you so curious? If they're equally nice, uh, then it'd have to be the one with the hotter bod. <laughs> oh, boy. So looks are what's most important to you. That is exactly not what he said. What? Your first answer was just superficial. The second answer was your true beliefs. But you put the condition that you couldn't pick on personality for the second answer. Oh my goodness. Huh. So you really are that kind of guy. <sighs> that ain't fair. What about you? Come on, spill the beans. What kind of girl is your type? Oh my goodness. You already gave away your little trick, so... Oh my goodness. One with a great body on... One who's really smart. Makoto and... One trotted Mr. I guess Futaba. One who's really smart. Wait, are you talking about her? Well, we answered honestly. It's your turn next. <laughs> Actually, really smart could probably refer to Makoto or Futaba, yeah? So, what kind of guy do you... Oh, God. So, what kind of guy do you... No, don't ignore it, Ryuji. Oh, Was that the bathtub? Uh, uh... 
That doesn't sound good. You know, wasn't he drinking the tap water earlier? Oh, fuck. You think they'd filter that pretty fucking good at hotel? That's like the one thing you're not supposed to do when you're out of the country. Is it? I'll keep that in mind. I've never heard that one before. Then again, I've only gone out of the country to, like, Canada, so... No, I believe that is a wise decision. Though it was some third-rate tabloids article, unnecessary information was leaked after all. Hmm. Besides, his investigation of the Phantom Thieves showed no progress since then. Yes, there's a possibility that he'll betray us out of spite since he was let go. Well then, we'll make it so that it was a heart attack. As usual, He'll be left to deal with the... Oh? I wouldn't have thought of that. Well played, sir. It no longer matters if we deal with one or two of those connected to us. Hmm? Oh, fuck. They're gonna kill people and blame it on the Phantom Thieves, aren't they? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck, and we're not even 69 anymore. Oh, what is the point in... Oh, no, things are going badly. Ah, oh, our high point was definitely the 69. <sighs> our trip is almost over. By tomorrow night, we'll be in, uh, we'll be on the airplane heading home. Damn it, Damn it. this isn't how stuff was supposed to go. Oh. Wait, what, what did you expect to happen? What do you mean? We ended up walking around the same as we always do in Japan. I mean, we even ate at a fucking Big Bang Burger. It's like we never left. Well, you'll like, but that's what the trip was supposed to be. But we weren't... But weren't some other guys getting out cozy with their girlfriends or some shit? Haha, <laughs> I think. As I was saying... Oh, that's it. That's what this trip is missing. Come on. We totally gotta get moving during our free time in the afternoon, right? I'm sort of getting a feeling if I had a, a relationship at this point. I could have, but I don't. What are we going to do? Ah, make a once in a lifetime summer memory. Hawaii is famous for its beaches, and you know, you know what happens in Hawaii stays in Hawaii. No, that's not the saying. It's definitely not the saying. <laughs> and get some girls' numbers during the day, sneak it, uh, sneak it, and then sneak away to them at night. You in or what? Me too. Oh, it'll be great. Neither of us have uh, girlfriends who get mad at us about it either. I guess that's true, but... Hey, come on. I know you're acting all cool, but you're totally coming with. No question about it. Oh, me? Oh, we'll see. Oh, you get a message? Who get that? Whoa. Uh, actually, you don't get to answer that. It might be something about you know what. You know what, what? Come on, Mijima, let's go. Wh Wait, what? Wh what just happened? It's only going to be the two of us, uh, Scamato? Oh, okay. Don't give me that look. We're going to Waikiki. Try and get a little bit more excited. <sighs> Man. Oh, don't you love school trips where you get dragged along to do stuff that you don't really want? Could have been a message about the Phantom Thieves. I should check when there's nobody else around. Oh, could be. Or maybe I could just read it like I always fucking do. Okay, well, this probably was the safe way. I'd love to go for a walk on the beach. We're in Hawaii, after all. I can finally take a break from my job, too. If you don't have any plans, would you like to take a walk with me? Yes, 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 yes. I heard Shujin is here in Hawaii, so I want to say hi. My school is giving some free time to do as we please. Care to take a walk along the beach? It might help with the with new moves. <laughs> Probably not. What was that message earlier uh, from? Was it from Futaba? Oh, wait, don't tell me. Was it a girl? Oh, come on. You gotta make memories with us instead. We bombed in the beach in Japan, after all. <laughs> oh, it's my last moment of free time. Who should I spend it with? No fucking question asked. Let's do it. Really? Thank you. Should I wear a swimsuit? Well, see you later. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> I guess because I already rejected the romantic advances of On to some extent, I can't do it with her. We're meeting at the beach. I should hurry and change into my swimsuit. Yes! I was far enough along with her. Yes! 
<laughs> oh, that's great. Sorry to ask you out here so suddenly. It seems like Makoto has been waiting for me here. Being a chaperone is more difficult than I expected. We've had a lot of meetings. <laughs> meetings on... Meetings on what exactly? I honestly wanted to contact you earlier, but this is the first free moment I've had. Ah, don't worry about it. Let's enjoy it then. That sounds lovely. Alright then. Let's take a walk. Oh, a food stand. Garlic shrimp. I've heard that's a famous Hawaiian dish. I don't like garlic. I'm the sort of person when I order pizza, I say no garlic crust. I want plain crust because plain crust tastes better than garlic. Damn it. Okay, we're gonna Are get it, aren't we? Adventurous when it comes to food? Not really. No, actually, I'm pretty set in my ways and what I like, and I don't really go out of my way to try other stuff. I mean, I'll try other stuff if it comes up, and... Well, I'll, I'll try other stuff if the opportunity is there and immediately in front of me, but I don't typically go out of my way for it. It depends, I suppose. Is that so? I usually go for the standard fare, but this is just shrimp and garlic, so... I should be fine. Oh god. Oh god. You saying that just makes me feel as though this is gonna go well. Well, let's give it a try. You two from Japan? Uh, yes, we are. How about them phantom thieves, huh? The guys that steal hearts. <laughs> oh, okay. How do you know about them? Heard about it on the news. They're all the rage in Japan, yeah? Seems like we're even making headlines abroad. Say, if you run into them, tell them I say hello. <laughs> and ask them to change people's hearts so everyone loves shrimp. Oh my. <laughs> oh, my goodness. This person. Uh, uh, of course. I'll do just that. I, I don't even fucking know where to start. <laughs> oh, I hope it's good. The owner gave us a heaping pile of extra shrimp. Oh, great. That's amazing. I don't think we'll be able to finish this all. We gazed over the ocean while we enjoyed the delicate flavors of foreign country. How beautiful. Oh, this is nice. Oh, it's already so late. My sister would be upset if she saw me laid back like this. <laughs> oh, don't worry about your sister. She has weird priorities. To tell you the truth, I wasn't particularly eager to go on this trip. But if it's like this, I think I'd like to come again. Ah. Chaperone is next year, too. Do we get to go on a third year trip, too? <laughs> you know I'm graduating this year. Oh, come on, make the extra effort. <laughs> um, I'd like you to have this. Oh, thank you. Small wooden keychain. It's dignified, yet a warm expression. Uh, the warm expression is reminiscent of Makoto. It's not the best souvenir, but it will remind you of the memories we made today. I love it. Thank goodness. It's it's the thought mainly. The fact that you went out and did oh, we anything that's great. Return before it gets dark. We still have some time. I suppose I can't complain about that. The two of us basked in the stunning Hawaiian sunset. Just me and Makoto. I like that one. I like that one. <laughs> Ah, uh, it's terrible getting dragged around by Sakamoto all day. Do you think I'll be, uh, you think I'll have to go through this on future school events as well? Um, you'll survive, Mishima. You'll survive. <laughs> uh, thanks? 
I guess I didn't exactly turn down the invite either. Huh. <sighs> I don't know. It's fun hanging out with Skamato, but he might be too different for me. Is getting a girlfriend my only way out of the situation? Oh. oh well. Anyway, we need to wake up early tomorrow. Let's get some sleep, okay? You know people are close when they complain about having to uh, hang out with each other. <laughs> oh my goodness, it's just fucking going up and up and up and up and up. It, it is a self. It is just like a pile, like a ball of dirt or snow. No, a snow would be a good metaphor. Just rolling down a, a hill of snow. And it's just getting bigger and bigger on its own. We, we pushed it. We don't even have to touch it anymore. I, we should probably do something else, but we should be really careful. Really, really careful. The school trip is finally coming to a close. Never thought I would have the chance to go on this one, uh, the one this year as well. It barely even felt like I was out of country, though. Even Yusuke showed up. For all the different things Yusuke did. Oh my, he had such a large impact on this Hawaiian story. That aside. I simply, um, I'm simply glad the storm didn't make its way over here. It may, uh, it may have not been the most exciting trip, but we still had a good time. I like when the game is like, it wasn't really all that exciting. This is like a super realistic trip. <laughs> Honestly, though, I'm thankful we didn't have to deal with the storm. I truly are oh, dreadful. Okay, we've been over the storm already, uh, Yusuke. So, what you end up doing yesterday? You keeping secrets from me? That's against the bro code. Hm. I was, uh, with someone. For real? Dude, for real? Ah. Oh. Actually, you know what? Don't say anything. Last thing I need is your secret lover coming after me with an axe. <laughs> Makoto just takes out and just like, it's just like, it would be funny if like during that time, like Ryuji was saying, oh, I don't need coming out with an axe. And then you just look over, you see Makoto's like, has an axe halfway out, then just puts it back. <laughs> That's enough, you guys. All right, then. It's almost time for us to leave. I felt like this trip really went by in a flash. I'm not sure if I want to go home or stay here longer at this point. <laughs> ah, I'm ready to head home and get back to work. Yes, it would be best for us to get the clues on that case sooner rather than later, correct? Yeah! Ah, people totally waiting for us to take action. Hmm. Ooh. Oh! Did we have this loading screen on the way here? I don't think we did. Pretty dope loading screen, though. Ooh, okay. Oh god, is it gonna be a heart attack time? They said heart attack, right? Or maybe something else entirely. Oh god. Oh god. He's an asshole, but no, 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 no. If we were out of country, they could just, like, leave a calling card. And we wouldn't even be able to do anything about it, or even know about it. Um... How do you not see... Oh, great. No, no. Wait, what's coming out of his mouth? Oh no. And it still goes up. Oh great. Okay. I think this is more important than the Big Bang Burger at the moment. This is much more important. Yo, welcome back. You get tanned a bit? Huh. Um I don't think so. How is Hawaii? Hello, uh nah. It was pretty normal. It was nice, but it was pretty normal. You left the country and it was just normal? Yeah. Such is the nature of being connected to most of the world already. You get to experience different cultures and whatnot, but if you're just going to a tourist destination, then you're not really experiencing different cultures. You're just seeing, like, the very skin-deep stuff at the, uh, at the most. 
While you guys were off having fun, things here have gotten a bit more problematic. Hmm. Um, okay. So I've heard the surprisingly hot items at the moment are masks and calling cards. <sighs> Wait, how do they know about the mask? Oh, oh no, right. Because of the logo, right? Because of the logo, right? Here's a graph of the profits for stores handling these items. Oh god. Oh god. Last year. Phantom Thief goods seem to be in especially high demand. I didn't know they sold that kind of stuff. Should we try too? I mean, selling Phantom Thief merchandise? <laughs> what? <laughs> no. Who would come here looking for that sort of stuff? Um, like Phantom Thief Curry? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'll toss some dry ice on the side, you know? Give it that phantom -y effect. <laughs> You know what? You know what? That hasn't. That's actually a cool. You know what? That's actually a pretty good idea. Uh, I'm just joking, all right? No, actually, that's a good idea. Make it a special for like a day or so. It would be pretty cool, right? I wonder how our guests consider this recent phenomenon. What do you think, Akechi Kun? Ha! <laughs> hey, TV detective. Well. There he is, the anti-thief detective. I hope he slips up and self-destructs. <laughs> I can sense some chivalry behind their actions. They are clever to take the silent resentments of the public into account and relieve them. And? I believe that may be the secret to their popularity. Well, this is surprising. Your stance seems to have softened. This doesn't change the fact that they are dangerous. However, no. Come on, you can say it. Oh no, I won't be falling for that. I've learned my lesson after the previous backfire. These thieves are more popular than the police or politicians. What's the world coming to? Rude. Actually, Shut up, Futaba. You're as bad as Ryuji sometimes. Now, here's the thing. Politicians have never really been that popular, you know. Police, yeah, I guess it depends on the country and the part of the culture in the country. In America. <laughs> I wouldn't say police are very popular. I wouldn't say they don't have the best reputation. I won't go into that. I, I feel as though... There's a whole discussion for that that has no necessary meaning for being in this video. What are you so angry about? Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, if it's I'll be more suspicious. I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Take care of any customers that show up. I thank you, Sojo, for just dropping it. I finished the analysis. You know, of the data. Wanna meet now? Hmm. <laughs> Oh, okay. Seriously? Jet lag? Fine then. Tomorrow. I can't help it. I should probably just slept on the fucking plane though. What is that? That's so cool. Ah, the Phantom Thieves stamp. Oh, isn't it awesome? What do you think the Phantom Thieves will uh who do you think they'll target next? I wonder. I'm really excited to find out. I, I don't care who it is, just do it already. Oh god. Oh god. This is getting out of control. This is getting out of this is getting way out of control. Hey, got a minute. Yeah. You look sleepy. No, you know, I can talk. Let's talk some other time. You should go to sleep for tonight though. You look exhausted. I can talk. You obviously need to talk to someone. Ah, <sighs> fine. God. Is this thing? Nice. Oh, it's still healthy. Oh. Actually, there's something I want to talk to you about. Uh, never mind, you should probably get some rest. Don't worry, it's nothing important. It's obviously important. It's obviously extremely important. Even if it's just your personal struggles, you can talk to me about it. Ah. Hey, sis. You just got back from your trip and you're already studying? How diligent. I have souvenirs for you. 
The principal of Shujin Academy has passed away. Ooh. <laughs> he suddenly stopped while crossing the road and was struck by a large vehicle. Death by external trauma. They say suicide seems to be a strong possibility. Principal Kobayakawa committed suicide? But would someone about to kill themselves try to go to the police station? He even used a taxi to get there. Do you mean this might be another incident? Even if he had a sudden shift in his state of mind, it's still unnatural. I can only suspect that he had a change of heart. Are you saying he was targeted by the Phantom Thieves? Oh god, they're assuming that it's connected. They're assuming it's connected at this point, aren't they? But that's impossible! How are you so certain? <laughs> what a great way to ask to make her back off. Well, in prior cases, the changes of heart seem to be done to make people confess their crimes. It's hard to explain, but this incident seems contradictory to their usual modus operandi. Did Principal Kobayakawa seem any different to you lately? Hmm... Good question. I don't really know. He rarely contacted the students, after all. I see. Could something have happened during the school trip? Oh, you're studying. I'm sorry to bother you. Makoto? Never mind, it's nothing. Just don't get dragged into trouble, okay? Oh, way too late for that. Way too late for that. It's fine, though. She's in good trouble. This is bad. I'd better tell the others. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Please do. Please do. Hey, it's the first time in a while, uh, it's the first time at school in a while. Ah, I'm so sleepy. Mm, you over your jet lag? Not yet. Not yet. Ugh, still working on that. <laughs> so sluggish, huh? Huh, I can say the same for, sh uh, for myself. Never mind that, though. You know about this? Fan fleas are popular now. I was surprised when we got back to Japan. People are actually paying attention to who they're gonna target next. Ain't that amazing? I'm getting real psyched. This is where we work hard. Let's do some big and surprise the world. Hmm. Hmm. What about class? Oh, there's another urgent assembly. Is it true he died? He was. He was really taking some heat. What's happening to this? What is happening to the school? Are we cursed? Maybe. Starting to feel like it. I remember seeing that Shujin means prisoner in Japan, so. This has to be about you know what, right? With the principal. And we will now begin the emergency morning assembly. As many. I wonder if that suicide one was for oh, real. Oh, my bad. It happened in front of the police station, didn't it? As many of you may already know, Principal Kobayakawa passed away yesterday. <sighs> that spread quickly. It spread extremely quickly. I think I was passing through there at the time. At the very least, if they're blaming the manslaughter on us, we do have an alibi of being in Japan. Yeah. I mean, the fact that we're caught in talking to Sai later. There's an alibi. The principal have been working hard to restore peace. school life and because of that love love bullshit he was covering something up everyone's been talking about it maybe it wasn't suicide do you think the phantom thieves took him down 
No, please don't. Please don't blame it on it. Please don't. The Phantom Thieves? Do they kill people? If people are going to start accepting that we kill people, everyone's death can be up for being our fault then. Not just him. I mean, Kamoshida did say he was going to kill himself to make up for everything he did. Oh, crap. That would be amazing. Either way, it serves that principle right. Hell no. We didn't do jack shit. Shh, 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 shh. Don't, no, don't. Are people going to blame us for this, too? I would like to see everyone live up to our late principal's wishes as proud Shujin students, and... <laughs> and it's okay... Eh, it's been a while, Sai. <laughs> I had noticed traces of tampering. Does that mean you truly took the data from my laptop? Oh. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. No matter how I think about it, that would have been impossible unless Makoto was helping you. But she would never do something so foolish. Peer pressure, peer pressure. It really was. And is it true Let's that you honest. were completely uninvolved with the Kobayakawa case? Mm hmm? <sighs> we don't kill. What does this mean? <sighs> but I suppose targeting someone at Shujin again and actually taking their life would be nonsensical. Mm-hmm. That's right. I have no reason to believe everything you've said. Right. But you wanna, don't you? However, it seems you aren't the type of person who would lie just to protect themselves. But I would be the type to make up romantic adventures with your sister. Let's do that. <laughs> I will acknowledge what I must. It's more efficient that way. I feel like my bottom size growing deeper. Man, this is one really close. We're going up to rank four in one interview? One interrogation? All right. Oh, that's impressive. In its own weird way. In any case, let's move on to the topic at hand. If you saw my investigation data, you would have had the same suspicions I did about Okumura. And if you looked into his palace, you should have seen the answer to those suspicions. Tell me, what did the Phantom Thieves do to Okumura? What did you learn from him? Why did it turn out as it did? I need you to tell me everything. So, Kabai Kawa is going to be the manslaughter? Oh, uh, hopefully that means Okuma, uh, Okumura doesn't have to die. Oh, I hope so. Oh, I motherfucking hope so. Before we talk about the data we got from Sis, we need to discuss the incident with the principal. Yeah. Yeah. Especially if people are going to be blaming it on us. People are already talking about it online. Mm-hmm. We have to be- okay, what are they saying? Specifically. Nobody's saying it's because of the Phantom Thieves. So far. <laughs> okay, good. Good. But... No calling card, right? So they didn't make a calling card. They would be saying it by now if they actually did something like that, right? People think he did it because that tabloid exposed how he was covering up Kamoshida's abuses. Could it be that... We are responsible for Principal Kobayakawa's suicide? No, I mean... As much as Kamashita would be, as much as him himself would be, if it was actually a suicide, a logical cause and event... Uh, the cause and event chain... You can only do so... You can't say like, oh, if we just change this little thing, this person wouldn't have died. And yes, that's true, but you can't go blaming yourself or stuff like that. One little event causing this butterfly effect that causes someone to die. Probably more than one person to die. Everything you do probably results in someone else's fate being changed, your own fate being changed. And you can't get wrapped up in that, or else it's just going to keep getting worse and worse in your head. And you, No, it's, it, it's a... It's a cycle that just builds onto itself and is not healthy. What do you mean? 
even from a responsibility point of view, that's unreasonable. You'd be charging anyone in the chain of uh, uh, cause and effect. If we hadn't changed Kamoshida's heart, maybe this never would have happened. But then Kamoshida would have kept doing what he did if we didn't go and take him down. There's a lot of opinions online. It's only natural that he died. Covering up crimes is wrong. The comments I've seen are similar as well. Only the phantom thieves are on our side. <sighs> yeah. You know what? No. Those people are idiots. I appreciate the support, but if you if you try to play sides too much, then you're an idiot. I wish the phantom thieves would take down the police and the politicians of this country. <laughs> Do fucking what? Just make them change their hearts? Oh my. It's not just the news. There's even Phantom Thieves merchandise now. I never expected we'd end up such a big deal. It seems like the public would rather believe in us than in the adults. People are trying to get the Phantom Thieves to solve societal problems, not just personal ones. This is kind of scary. Are we really doing the right thing? I mean, the principal was covering stuff up, right? I guess he got what was coming to him. No. No, Ryuji, no. Death is never an option. Never. We may not... We may have been part of the cause and chain effect, but we cannot accept it as an acceptable outcome. We need to... Maybe it's our fault, maybe it's not, but maybe we can do better. Come on, don't go... No. No, I will never accept that as a conclusion. Whoa, guys, let's get back on topic. Weren't we going to discuss the data we obtained from Nijima? You tell them, Inari. Why me? First, Prosecutor Nijima has been looking into the continued cases of people suddenly collapsing. It seems she is searching for a common thread to tie them all together. Some parts seem to be speculation, but she has cited a beneficiary of the majority of these incidents. The corporation Okumura Foods, more prominently its CEO, Kunikazu Okumura. Okumura? I feel like I've heard that name somewhere. From Big Bang Burger, Big Bang Burger? For real? You know, they only got famous sometime in the past few years. They even had a branch in Hawaii. It says here they benefited both from scandals and the resignations of their competitors' executives. That would seem to be the case. This is too suspicious, though. Only one CEO is profiting from these seemingly accidental mm. incidents. Oh, yeah, definitely. I think it's natural to suspect he's intentionally causing them. But... Is he on the chopping block? Is he like a Kabayaka... Is he like a Kabayakawa? Is he... Mm. I have a feeling how this is going to go. We're gonna go in, try to change his heart at the last minute. Like Akechi or someone else. Whoever is in the black, uh, black mask is going to... Uh, jump in, kill their shadow, and we're going to, after sending the calling card, get blamed for a death. I get that, but still. We have even more evidence than that. Tell them, Futaba. They already tried putting Okumura's name in the NAF. He has a palace for sure. That settles it then. He's totally our next target. That's right. Okumura is at the top of the rankings, after all. <sighs> I wonder why that is. It is a rumor, but he's still at the top of the rankings. It... <sighs> I get a feeling like they they could have used like bots in order to vote and push him to the top of the rankings because they want us to go after him. Hold on, <sighs> that doesn't necessarily mean he's evil. If we jump into this too carelessly. Then, let's go do some investigation, find his palace, go into his palace, not necessarily steal anything, but if we find any evidence of corruption or evil intent or whatever, then that's how we typically should go about this, yeah? 
Beyond that, this phantom thieves fad is unsettling. Yeah, the excitement levels don't feel normal. We might want to let things calm down a bit first. <sighs> you know what? That's actually a pretty good idea. You too, on? You're just gonna go against what people want? No, but no. <sighs> that's not a good reason to do this. Huh? No, but. <clears throat> For real? L looks like we're not gonna agree today then. Sheesh, some team you are. What's with all the hesitation? I can't stand this. Even you, Ryuji. You just back down the second someone disagrees with you. What? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I guess all you've been talking about is using the Phantom Thieves' name to pick up girls anyway. Uh, I mean... No, I don't think it's about picking up girls. Though, then again, he does seem primarily focused on the whole... attention part of it. Being hyped up because of the popularity is fine, but getting conceited over it is unacceptable. Hey! Aren't you acting for your own benefit here too? My appearance might have changed, but I'm still an admirable human. At the very least, I'm more admirable than some carnal blonde monkey! You little... Fine. I can take on some small-time target like Okumura on my own. No, you cannot. You could not even take how much she... Oh, crap. Sorry, but it looks like I'll be getting the credit for solving the mental shutdown mystery. Well, she was more useful than you, as a matter of fact. Hey, that's inexcusable! I'm going to show you who the useless one actually is. All right, then. Bring it on! Ryuji, stop! Looks like I don't belong here after all. No. Morgana. You just needed to fucking talk to me. Oh, my goodness. Well, this is goodbye. Calm down, man. No. Morgana, wait. See you. <sighs> I bet he's back in no time. Hmm. <sighs> Damn it. Why? I'm human, I have to be. Hmm. Alright, I've managed to uh, buy myself before, and I can do it again now. I just need to take down Okamura before those guys do. Have you taken down anyone before? You said you never got to the point of actually stealing a heart, right? Oh, see ya, Magana. Huh, that Hi. kitty. You recognize it as the one that's always in my bag? Oh, great. I can't believe this. The public believes in the justice of the Phantom Thieves. They have no interest in that principle. I'm experiencing equal levels of frustration. My comments on TV turned everyone against me. Hmm. Hmm. Then again, I won't allow mere criticism to break my spirit so easily. We won't keep letting ourselves be defeated either. My suspicion after the hacker's case last month is now conviction thanks to the principal's death. The mental shutdown cases and the psychotic breakdowns are surely the Phantom Thieves' doing. I remember the data you showed me about Okumura Foods. Is that the basis for these beliefs? Hmm. There have been frequent occurrences of mental shutdowns surrounding Okumura recently. If only there was a clear connection between him and the Phantom Thieves. Well, it would be problematic if there wasn't one. So, you're jumping the gun here. Basically, you want to get everything wrapped up in one nice package. You really told a man you would terminate his parental authority based purely on your speculation? Oh, yes, let's bring that up. Let's bring that up. 
I'm surprised you would say such a thing to the owner of a cafe you frequent. Oh. And is that why you, Akechi, went out there yourself to talk to him? It's all for the sake of the case. That's not a justification. Oh, my goodness. You may have the backing of the SIU's director, but you've been far too aggressive, Sai-san. You're trespassing into police territory. Don't say nobody warned you if this becomes an issue later. My superiors told me the same thing. We first need to know what methods the Phantom Thieves are using. The police can't make a move unless that becomes apparent, after all. This opponent can't be caught by following the rules. What need is there to stick to formalities? Hmm. So, you wish to ignore protocol in order to reform society? I hope you realize that's no different than what the Phantom Thieves are doing. It's a shame. Especially since we both want to capture the culprit behind the psychotic breakdowns. Huh. Akechi seemed much less in control I'm of really the... Messed up. Oh, that was fast. That was really fast. Shall we dispose of it? Ooh, okay. How did he... Well, let's see. This is like electronic. Maybe it's supposed to be uh, the internet or something? Leave it be. We do not have time to waste on a solitary feline. Oh, maybe these are like... Okay, the, uh, for some reason I was thinking it was like Okamura's shadow. These are probably just the normal shadows, yeah? Is this really... impossible alone? Dude, Morgana, I don't even think I could do it alone, so... How horrible! Oh god, is that that girl? Sort of looks like your hairstyle and that silhouette, and it sort of sounded like your voice, yeah? Ugh. Oh, yeah. Oh, don't tell me she's the one in the black mask. Huh. <laughs> okay, interesting. Very interesting. Okay. I was not expecting her to show up there. I was definitely not fucking expecting her to show up there. Good morning. Hey, have you seen Morgana? Hmm, I'm worried. Yeah. No, I haven't. Me too. I'm just, I just kind of expected he'd come home when he got hungry. Oh, okay, maybe he went to someone else's place. Let's, let's ask. Hmm. Organa's still not back. Hmm, he hasn't come home yet. Uh, the food's still in, the food's still in his bowl too. You really think he just took off like that? He's a cat, so it's possible he got into an accident. Does it? Does he really seem to be the type who just go off and die? And I was like that though. That's only been one day. Y'all worrying too much. He's probably just off doing his own stuff. I mean, he used to live alone, remember? Just don't worry about it. I'm sure he'll come back if something happens. <laughs> something already happened, apparently. Aren't they all being way too cold about this? Oh well. Have a good day. Well, I'm happy at least you're worried about Morgana. Someone has to be. There's no one like the Phantom I Thieves. By that, our principal death was an accident. I think the Phantom Thieves killed him. No, please don't believe that. You think the Phantom Thieves uh, murdered him? But why? Think about Kamashita's victims. The prin uh, principal's just as guilty for keeping quiet about it all. People who take advantage of others for their own personal gain need to disappear. In fact, we need uh, scumbag cleansing to, the, uh, to purify this world. Oh shit, I have a feeling there's a lot of scumbags in the Phantom Thieves supporters too, so... <laughs> a scumbag is basically whoever you want it to be at sometimes. Sometimes it is completely relative. And once you get into that mentality, good versus evil. Then you start getting that sort of delusion. <sighs> Yesterday, uh, my wife threw out one of my books without asking me. The Okuma away. It was even signs. Huh? The what? With his logical management skills, he revived his company that was on the verge of bankruptcy. He then started Big Bang Burger, a bold and creative venture. Okuma's words are philosophy on life itself. 
How could she uh, sell that to a second-hand shop? Uh, holy shit. You have a dedication. But in, uh, in times like these, getting one's mind to switch gears is key. Wouldn't you agree, pikachu -Kun? Uh, no, okay, switching from relaxing to paying attention. Second-hand shops are also known as thrift stores. Do you know when the earliest ones appeared? <laughs> probably, probably really early. Because, I mean, we've been trading goods for forever, yeah? Huh, okay. I guess. Very good. Correct. They were mostly run by religious or uh, charitable organizations, of course. But larger businesses could donate unused stock to them and use them as a tax write off that way. It takes incredible business acumen to figure out how to be both profitable and charitable at once. Does it? We could just be charitable, not looking for ways to be profitable specifically. I mean, it's good if it can also be profitable, but you should also just try to be charitable. I don't know. Wow, he actually knew that. Woo! Hmm. All right. I just remembered. The uh, rumors that President uh, Okamura may be uh, getting into politics. <sighs> of course. It is true that the current administration is incompetent in a number of ways. I would love to have a charismatic man like that leading the country. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. That just sounds horrible. Hey, come straight over once school's over, okay? You better. Um, what's wrong? We're going to wait in case Morgana comes home. You don't need me to be home for that, right? Anyway, come straight home. I I wonder what's up with Morgana, though. He should just hurry and come back. Oh, you're really worried. Yeah, like her awakening with Mona. Mona's still not home. I'm sure he'll come back when he gets hungry. On to our next story. Late last night, multiple glass windows were found shattered at the Okumura Foods corporate headquarters. Hmm. Hey, th this is that Okumura. Other damages have also been reported, including the destruction of a statue depicting Mr. Okumura. Huh. That's... odd. Hmm. wonder if someone's got a grudge against that guy. However, there were no signs of a break-in. Identifying the culprit is expected to be difficult. You think Moment charged in there by himself? And broke the windows in order to get in? That's not usually how the palaces work, right? Mm, I suppose it's possible. Yeah, he may not seem like it sometimes, but he's totally a capable cat when he wants to be. Either way, let's let's go to Okamura's palace tomorrow. I'll contact everyone. Yeah, he's getting suspicious at this point. He has to be. He has to be. We're gonna win his Okamura's palace. Is that true, Futaba? Well, he did say he'd go alone. Does that mean he's in danger? The chances of that are highly likely. Yeah, we should go uh, in after him. The palace is most likely their corporate headquarters, right? I'll look into it a little bit more. Alright, let's do this. We gotta look into those mental shutdown things, too. I'd prefer a little more caution, but this is an emergency. Then we'll go tomorrow. Don't forget, everyone. Morgana. Oh, oh, look what people did today. Oh, shocking. Mm. You don't think... Oh, God. You don't think my 
the persona I left in the velvet room is gone, do you? Oh my goodness, Brigana's not here to tell me not to do stuff! Oh my goodness, I'm gonna play video games all night. Looks like the popularity of Thanathy's on the rise. Crap. <laughs> oh, okay. Good timing. Yay! Oh, I gotta be close to going up to four soon. Oh, come on! Ah, whatever. Oh, come here, foods. I like the guy in the rankings. Ah, apparently the windows in their office got busted. Whoa, what happened? That's scary. Was it the Phantom Thieves? Ah, no way. I wouldn't put past them. What? You know nothing of our methods. Why would you not put it past us? Oh my goodness, this is bad. Well, at least um, the hype apparently has uh, died down a bit. And we're going a bit more slowly. About the so, thieves. about the next target. Oh my goodness, the Phantom Thieves are so cool. So, about the next target. Hilarious. I heard my sister's boyfriend's friend got a calling card. Yeah, why don't you just put a request into the Phantom Thieves? Man, this place sucks. My boss is just the worst. Impossible. All he does is dump overtime on me while he dashes off uh, right at five. Wish the fan thieves would work their magic on him. Uh, what would that be like if they change his heart? Uh, they say you become uh, the opposite of how you normally are. So I guess he'd uh, become more open-minded, communicate better, and start taking initiative. He'd basically be, um, he'd basically be as awesome as the president of Okamura Foods. <laughs> please, Phantom, please, please make this happen. Okay, we we are definitely growing way bigger than we're actually capable of. Holy crap, this place is huge. Crap. Yeah. Just a few years and they have this big of a corporate office. Damn. It is the headquarters of a large corporation after all. Right, but weren't they on the verge of bankruptcy like just a few years ago? If anything... Getting into the real building is impossible. Mona seriously went to a palace based on somewhere like this? It's definitely on a different scale than the ones we've dealt with previously. I searched Okumura online. He's totally up to something. Don't you think he's guilty too? Oh my goodness, don't just say he's guilty. That's not how it should ever work. No. We'll know soon enough. Call me a tits for Yuji. I'm positive I'm right. I don't care. I don't care in the slightest how positive you are. We're here for Mona. I know. I know. We gotta make sure we squeeze the juice on those mental shutdown things out of him too. You said you found the palace keywords, right, Futaba? The corporate HQ is outer space. Huh. That's weird. What, does he see himself as literal above each other? Huh? The hell? Instead of being a flying palace, it's like literally in space. Oh, so that's why it's called Big Bang Burger. Big Bang is space lingo, you know? Um, not necessarily. So the concept behind the store branch name came from the CEO himself. Outer space, hmm? How exciting. Yeah, we even get some Daleks. We better be able to breathe once we get in there. Oh, that's a good point. Maybe Mona went in and she, um, he just suffocated. Is everyone ready? I'm activating it now. Oh, crap. <laughs> He was able to understand Mona, so he's definitely been in here before, yeah? And he just happened to be here. Oh god, that's a fucking hell of a coincidence. That's a fucking hell of a coincidence. They're already considered threats? President Okumura must be on guard, what with everything that's been in the news. Oh yeah, and also being on the top of the rankings, yeah? That bastard. He's just causing more trouble for us. 
there's no fucking way he's not aware of it, at the very least. Uh, considering how popular Phantom Thieves have become. Whoa. Yeah. I gotta admit, this is pretty darn cool. It's as though we're in a film. I wish I had brought my sketchbook. <laughs> I'm surprised you don't bring that all the time. Hey. Oh, that might be in here somewhere, yeah? Come on, we gotta go look for him. Okay, I think that's where I'm going to leave it for today. Oh, this place. Oh, I like this music, too. It's very driving. Dun, 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 dun. Hmm. And there's a big yellow thing. I bet that's like a teleporter or some shit. Let's, you know what? Let's, let's just head back. Joker. <laughs> Come on, dude. We gotta look a little bit more. Oh, whatever. Okay. Oh, I only have two party members. <laughs> okay, well, I'll see you all next time. Drive safely, everyone. It's not a cave. I'm not a